Hey guys, what's going on? Frank Richard, Rebuilt Recovery. And in today's video, I want to talk to you about what are you going to need to change both inside of you and inside of your life in order for you to successfully quit porn, reboot and rewire your brain for good and live a porn-free life and become the man that you were created to be. But before we jump into today's video, guys, let me remind you who we are and what we do here. My name is Frank Rich, CEO, founder, and head coach at Rebuilt Recovery, and it is our mission to help men break free from the shackles of porn addiction through the power of faith and fitness. Now, we do that in a handful of different ways. First off, right here on the Rebuild Your Life YouTube channel, we are releasing new videos every single day, Monday through Friday at this point. So if you're new to the channel and haven't done so yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button right there and also turn those post notifications on so you are notified every single time a new video is released. And secondly, for you guys in the early stage of trying to identify all the ways in which porn has had a negative impact on your life and are curious about what life could look like for you once you've been able to remove this destructive habit out of your life and step into that life that you were created to live. Make sure to download our free ebook. It's the seven step guide to living life without porn where I walk you through the exact process that we use with our students and clients here at Rebuild Recovery on how to identify all the ways in which porn has had a negative impact on your life. How to then take that and build a proactive plan to get you out of the depths of this addiction and stepping into the life that you were created to live. But most importantly, what do you need to do to hold yourself accountable? What do you need to do to build up the discipline, build up the willpower, and actually execute upon the plan that you've put together for yourself every single day and live a porn-free life? So that's a seven-step guide to living life without porn. I'm going to link it down there in the first pinned comment below. So after today's video, guys, make sure to visit that page and download the book. But let's get back to today's video, guys. What do you need to change about yourself? And what will happen once you finally make this shift in your life and in, 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 in yourself? And why this is going to be the most important step for you in successfully quitting and rebooting yourself for good. And here's what it is, guys, is your identity needs to change. Your identity is, is, is what drives your thoughts at the unconscious and conscious level. It's driving everything about you. Every action that you take, every behavior that you, that you participate in, every thought that you have starts with your self-identity. Who do you think you are? Who do you view yourself to be? And there's so many variables that have shaped our identity, and a lot of times we are not in control of these things. You know, I was speaking with a, a, a world-renowned neuroscience last night, and, and, and the episode is releasing here very soon on the Superman Life, so make sure to subscribe to the podcast if you haven't done so yet. Um, but, but we were talking about how, how our thoughts and our memories drive our minds, and it, are, it is our mind that is controlling our identity. How are we viewing ourselves? How are we feeling about who we are becoming? How are we looking at ourselves, both from the inside and from the outside externally. And this is what's driving your behavior right now. You know, if you guys have, have been around for a while and you've seen more than a couple of videos on this channel, you've probably heard me say that in order to overcome your addiction to pornography, you must become the man that is no longer addicted to porn. And I put a lot of emphasis in root, a, a, a lot of emphasis into that word become. Who are we becoming on a daily basis is what is shaping our identity. And our identity is not fixed. It doesn't matter where you came from. It doesn't matter what your circumstances were growing up. It doesn't matter what trauma you dealt with. It doesn't matter what was the, the driving force for, for the initial time that you went and looked at pornography. If we're allowing those things to hold ourselves back, that's self-limiting beliefs. And I shot a video on self-limiting beliefs that you guys need to search on this channel. Um, but it's, but it, none of that controls us. We, it can control us if we don't take conscious awareness of it and we don't begin to shape our own identity. So what are some things that you could do to begin to shape your identity? Well, first it's understanding who you are and, and who created you. You know, we were all put on this earth with a very specific purpose. A dream was placed in your heart. Something was given to you in terms of a skill. And that skill is, is, is given to you in order to serve other people and make the world a better place. So if you're struggling with your self-identity right now, think about the skills and, and characteristics that uniquely define you and begin to find a way to use those to make other people's lives better. Secondly, is you need to start living and coming from a place of gratitude. You know, I talk a lot about how our, our mind and our brain shifts or, or, or it, it controls our perception of how we see the world. And when we can live in, 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 and operate from a place of gratitude and being grateful for everything that we have. And I know sometimes it can be hard. You know, we, we, we feel like this addiction is, is controlling our lives, it's controlling our thoughts, it's controlling every waking minute, minute of, of, of our day. And it feels like it's got complete control over us. But if we can begin to find things to be grateful for, 
upon rising, first thing in the morning, the first five minutes, you wake up, make your bed, turn the coffee on, and get in your journal and start finding things and recognizing them and acknowledging them. I'm so grateful that 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 that, that I'm awake today. I'm so grateful that that I actually have a job. 20 million people lost their jobs in the past year pandemic. You know, if you were fortunate and you were blessed to be able to keep yours, that's something that that separates you from from those other 20 million people. So I can tell you, brother, that is definitely something to be to be grateful for. We have a roof over our head. We have food on our plate. We have liquids and water to drink. So much, but it but it but it takes work. It takes effort, and it takes commitment, and it takes execution showing up on a daily basis. But if you don't change your identity, if you don't begin to change yourself and how you view yourself, then you're never going to fully be able to get out of this. You know, we've been we've we've been misled in in the addiction community that that addiction is a disease. It's, it's, it's something that's passed down from generations. It's something that we can't control. We can only take a drug or, uh, you know, whatever it is. And, and, and I know I'm speaking, you know, higher level here from, from addiction in general. Uh, but a lot of people think that, you know, porn is, is the same thing. It's, it's, yes, it's changed our mind. It's, it's, it's changed the wiring in, in our brain. But, it's, but, it's, but, but we've done that to ourselves because we haven't been able to take our eyes off of the screen. We haven't been able to fully get it out out of our lives once we can begin to shift our identity we begin to wake up every single day with the intention of becoming the man that is no longer addicted to porn and i think that can be something that every single one of us can do writing your journal every single morning i am the man that is becoming no longer addicted to pornography i'm no longer addicted to pornography i'm the man that does not look at pornography i'm the man that lives his life on purpose and with intention and because of that Pornography has no place in my life. Cycle through these things. You know, and these aren't these aren't affirmations. These aren't, you know, I'm gonna say this out into the world and, and, and my life is gonna change. And I don't I don't buy into the, the whole secret, you know, um, you know, uh, positive affirmations. I think you gotta do the work. Yeah, you gotta do the work. You gotta show up, you gotta do gratitude, you gotta stop consuming pornography, you gotta get in a healthy exercise and, 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 and nutrition routine, you gotta get into a community, you gotta get accountability. All the steps and layers that we teach you here on how to actually take back control. But it starts with an identity shift. It starts with changing who you are and who you see yourself and who it is you are becoming. And not until you do that will you fully be able to quit porn. Will you fully be able to take back control of your life? Will you fully be able to reboot and rewire your brain? So my hope and goal with this video is that maybe if you've been doubting yourself, maybe if you've been on the fence of like, hey, I, I, I think I understand what Frank is saying, but I'm too broken. Hey, I think I get it, but, but I'm different because you know X thing happened to me. My, my hope and goal and prayer with this video is that maybe this is the one that changes the day for you. Maybe this is the one that changes your life. Maybe this is the one that begins to light that fire inside of you to start the taking back control of your life. If that is the case, drop us down there a comment below and let me know, brother, I'm in. I'm ready to take back control of my life and I'm gonna do whatever it takes to become the man that is no longer addicted to porn. But Frank Chris from Rebuild Recovery, like I said at the beginning of the video, we are dropping videos every single day, Monday through Friday. So hit that subscribe button, turn those notifications on so you are notified when they are released. Download the free ebook. But Frank Rich from Rebuild Recovery, I'll see you guys tomorrow on the other side.